how awesome Jigglypuff is. Yeah, before is, you get is started, she awesome at all? She is way better than she was in Smash 4, I will say that. This is this the best iteration of Jigglypuff we've ever seen in Smash? Mm, that's debatable, but hey, the meta's still involving, so we'll see how she turns out. But right now, I just want to see how Mageta is going to do with his Jigglypuff in bracket. Before we get started, though, I just want to give a shout out to everyone in the chat. Shouts to Nem. Shoutouts to uh, shouts to Slowcoal. Shouts to Goku Gang, by the way. What's up, boy? What's up, bro? Shouts to Commander Root. Shouts to Hawks. Okay, got it. Yeah, thank you everybody for coming out tonight. Gonna get into it pretty soon. Now, Marth versus Jigglypuff, I feel like this heavily favors Marth in a lot of regards. Because if Jigglypuff gets literally just tipped by Marth's sword and shield broken, she's pretty much dead. Yeah, and also pro the exact range that Jigglypuff wants to be keeping her opponent at so that she can be kind of chipping in her damage or starting her combos is the is also the exact same range that Marth wants his opponent to be at so he could be landing, so he could be spacing. Who even knows if he has to get in this game, he could just hit Jigglypuff every time she tries to come in. Alright, so. here we go. The new starter villain, actually. Right now, this is just a button check. I'm trying to figure out how everyone's controls are working and stuff. Yeah, but PS2? I don't know if this is PS2 or PS1, but it looks so good. I love it. Um, I'm pretty sure this is 1. Okay. And I didn't think that this was legal. I don't know. No, it's definitely legal, just because the hazard's off. But yeah, shoutouts to uh, PS2. Is it with one Z or two? That's me, baby. That's me, baby. You play me. Oh, nice to meet you, finally. Hey. <laughs> if y'all didn't know, I just met the other boss the that's here tonight. Collide. We got <laughs> We got real life Echo Fighters here tonight. <laughs> Alright, both of them are just checking out their buttons and stuff. Yeah, Bronus was uh, getting his playlist set up, so he didn't quite get his button check. Magida got double the button check, double warmed up. There's so many people here tonight. I hope I get to do halfway decent, but we'll see. Oh yeah, I'm I'm I I am I'm searching for the wins. I'm gonna play so hard. I'm gonna play patient as well. It doesn't matter if I'm down a stock. <laughs> we have to find a way to shave off. That stock and get right back in the game. It's about <laughs> staying ice cold. Like, is the plural of boss boss, but with like apostrophe rags? I don't know. <laughs> Alright, I think they're all ready to go, so we're gonna get into it pretty pretty soon. Be sure guys to follow Source on all social media as well. Facebook, Twitter, YouTube. And on Twitch as well, too, if you aren't already subscribed. But, I mean, why aren't you already subscribed to Twitch? I mean, you're already watching us, so you might as well be. Go ahead and hit that like button real quick, or that follow. Can you still hear me? Oh, yeah, I can still hear you. Okay, heck, yeah, my mic went out, but sick. All right, we're getting into it, and already, Megita with the Jigglypuff combos. Man, has barely even been touched once. Okay. Sort of getting their feet caught up. Marth kind of... Caught a disadvantage there, but now here with stage control, Jigglypuff finding her way back on stage, and oh, that forward smash actually connecting. Oh, nice the edge guard! That was oh, sick. That. Nix. Hey, uh, my mic stopped working. I'm so, I didn't. Get, I'm not getting any sound in it. Guys, if you can hear, um, if you can hear Lo-Fi Ronin in the chat, please let us know. Oh, that almost broke her shield, but Marth with a nice neutral air. Rolling out all over the stage. <laughs> kind of just playing the footsie game here, but Marth catching Jiggly off guard. Got to stay slow, and, and this is uh, this is what I was talking about, that spacing game right there. It's going to be really hard for Julie Pup to get it going, but getting in with that side B there. Yeah, it's funny because in a way, like, sword characters can really just abuse that short hop aerial function by just hitting like jump in A. I really wish they could we could just turn that off. There was like an option to Like turn an it option off. just to like yeah, yeah just like people, cancel that out. Some of us might not like that. Jigglypuff going deep for the edge guard. Ooh. And that was a good way to get back on stage, but catching him with the forward air and the roll read with the grab. All right. 
He has nice. a pressure in the corner, but Marth asserts himself back into center stage, controlling the neutral. Oh. But that back air is so strong in this game. Yeah, like, Jigglypuff you've... is looking really strong. That was in the middle of the stage, and uh, Brontus has got to shave off this stock really quick and then do something fancy, and that's a good way to do it. Nice side smash there. Jigglypuff will die to anything, basically. Yeah, with Jigglypuff, it's kind of like you want to play characters that have sort of like this ranger like projectile game just because nice. she has to commit or they have to commit by going in and yeah. doing damage by being up close but with characters like sword characters like marth or like zoners with projectiles like Mega Man or maybe like toon link and stuff like they can really just like bait you out with like their tools and everything That's for jiggly to and just get exposed I mean, Maketa. Oh, I thought that, I thought he was gonna do the roll read to the rest. Oh, come on! I mess know. Up, up. Like we all want to see it. To be honest, he, he he had a couple. Oh, there we go. The nice up air up doing there. it. It's so funny because it's so slow, but it's so good. It's like not slow, but it comes out so slow. Look, she looks cute. Because it's, cause it's just like waving her hand. Like, it's like a super long. Like, like salutations, the everyone. The longest wave. I know. <laughs> But yeah, it's it's beautiful. The most extra wave, actually. Geta taking that first game very close. Was without playing Brontus in neutral just the whole time. Let's see. Okay, so Brontus' counter pick is going to be Battlefield. So I'm thinking he wants to get some platform juggles with up air, maybe. Or, okay. All right. We have another Samus player on stream. All right. Ahem, ahem. It's a Dark Samus. Samus. Excuse Thank me, you. everyone. Dark Samus. I, I, I don't, I don't. Oh, like Rocket that. the Pink skin, too. I see you. Go ahead and stun. Let's go. I don't like that Dark Samus skin. Really? Yeah. Really? Okay. I think the purple doesn't match, but it's not about that. It's about this. It's about this match. And I actually think Battlefield is worse for the Dark, for Dark Samus. Because Jigglypuff can uh, just dance around, dance around anything they're gonna try to do, and uh, has so many levels to get away from this setup game that Samus wants to do with her missiles. I definitely feel like fighting brawlers or people have to get like up close to scrap. It's definitely harder on Battlefield just because they have so many platform juggles. But I feel like with Dark Samus and Samus, like you have the option of just avoiding a lot of stuff with just directional air dodge because you're so floaty. Oh yeah. Nice and that, forward air. And see, that's one of the biggest buffs for Samus is just her forward air connects more reliably now than it did in previous games. Not going to tech there from Brontus, unfortunately, but he still makes it back on the stage. Nice neutral air to get stage control and got a fully charged bomb. Nice down tilt. I love that down tilt. That down tilt is so strong, especially at higher percents too. And uh, Mewtwo's down smash, how he just puts his finger down in the area right in front of him. Oh, okay. Brontus looking way more comfortable now that he was in game one. Oh yeah, and Brontus with the lead too. See if we can shave off Ooh. this stock. It's looking like a good edge guard. It's actually kind of hard to edge guard uh, Samus. It is a little bit. A, she can get yeah. back with a tether and oh, but nice neutral air catching him, catching him sleep lacking. Yeah, unfortunately, Brontus not really utilizing the tether just to quickly recover back onto stage. It is an option you always want to be aware of as a Samus player. Okay. That's another thing. Uh, up tilts are now more so like anti-airs now in this game rather than like combo starters. But Samus's up tilt is still a good combo starter just because you can get a lot of crazy stuff like up tilt to uh, up B at certain percents and it can kill a lot of characters pretty effectively. Cool. Jigglypuff racking on some damage now and with some momentum going for the crazy stuff off the edge. Oh, recklessly going in with the forward air there, almost getting punished, but blocking in time. One thing I do find a little bit harder to play with as Samus is like utilizing down air just because it's like the short hop function makes it like you kind of have to use it if you want to get the like the perfect like frame perfect down air. Yeah, I like to think of uh, I like to think I like when people use down air. Oh! Whoa! <laughs> that if was you so ask me, close. That, that Samus that didn't even hit Samus. That hit like the outer rim of the sh of the of the spark burst. That was insane. Yeah. Good aggression there from Brontus, but Ooh, oh, he could have got a rest. Off. Yeah, but, trying to ooh, trying to end that start. Oh no! Ooh, oh! Oh! Get sniped! <laughs> on, on the way, on the recovery back, Magita was lacking a little bit, not expecting that, but Brontus with a little bit of a lead now and. Yeah, you're right. 
Yeah. Looking, looking way more comfortable. Actually using the platform to his advantage a lot. Can't really get his uh, his uh, projectile game going, but man, he's making good use of this forward air and his upbeat. Yeah, a lot of it is just he's just beating out Jigglypuff in neutral whenever they get up close to each other. But finally, that back air evening up the stocks. One yeah, to one. Even up the stocks, but Jigglypuff at 42%. Oh no, okay, getting in a little, oh, nice forward air, but can't follow up with it. Ooh. Samus still with stage control. Fun fact for Samus, uh, at early percents, or for Dark Samus rather, early percents, falling forward air can combo into up smash really Come effectively. On. Ooh, uh, if he had charged that up all the way, that probably would have killed. Oh, oh, no follow up there, but. A fully charged. Shadow ball, whatever you want to call it. Whoa. That does look like a shadow ball, no lie. Oh, he tried to call him out there, but the directional air dodge will kill him. Oh, and when you shoot, no, oh, did he directional air dodge or did yes, he? Yes, he did. I yeah. thought the blast from the shot like blew him way too far away to get back. Well, also, that will happen too. So, 